I'm Carrie Manders for Spectrum Health. I'm in one of the Spectrum Health Blodgett Hospital operating rooms where surgeons are using a new procedure for knee replacement surgery. It's called macoplasty and it's less invasive and could mean shorter recovery times for patients. Enjoying a good book inside on a beautiful summer day isn't what Nancy Brunsma wants to be doing. I enjoy bike riding and hiking, uh, take my dog for long walks. I, I enjoy walking and uh, gardening. But a lifetime of osteoarthritis caused both of the 56-year-old's knees to become extremely painful. After partial knee replacement on her right knee, it was time for the left. This time, she was interested in a new robotic-assisted surgery offered at Spectrum Health Center for Joint Replacement. After researching macoplasty and speaking to the surgeon that um, this was going to give me the quality of life that I was hoping for. Nancy's surgeon, Dr. Thomas Malvitz, and Dr. Gregory Galladay were the first surgeons in Michigan to use this robotic technology. Here's how it works. By using three-dimensional imaging, the surgeon is able to pinpoint exactly where the arthritis is in the knee. Using a robotic arm, they can then precisely remove that part of the joint without taking the healthy bone, tissue, and ligaments around it. We always want to do whatever is going to be best for the patient. And anything that's going to allow us to be more precise, more accurate, more reproducible with the minimal amount of bone loss, we can also do this less invasively, which has an advantage to the patient. All of those things are, are the type of things that we should be trying to do. The new technology also allows for more accurate alignment and positioning of the implants that can mean a more natural feeling need to the patient. Just one of the many advantages Makoplasty offers. Patients, I think, they expect to recover more quickly. They expect to have a more normal, pain-free range of motion of their joint. They expect to spend less time in the hospital. They expect to go home rather than to a rehab. They expect to require less hands-on physical, physical therapy. They expect to take less medication than they might if they had a total knee replacement. And they expect that this result will be so precise and well done that it will be sustained over time. And I think that those are realistic expectations. Just two weeks after her surgery, Nancy is slowly getting back to the things she enjoys and is optimistic about her recovery. For more information about Makoplasty, go online to spectrum-health.org. For Spectrum Health, I'm Carrie Manders.